We're back. <laughs> Sorry we've been gone for a couple weeks and now we're back from Stanford and we're really excited to be here and we're going to the Sweet 16, so yeah. Yes, we won. We took out Stanford for the second time for Michigan Volleyball History and now we're gonna take you guys through some of our team and see what they're most excited about this coming weekend and what they enjoyed most about this weekend in Stanford. I'm really, really excited. We both are, yay. We seem to have really good luck at Stanford. I mean, I'm going to close out my career being 2-0 and against Stanford, which is which is pretty good, I would say. But um, yeah, definitely beating Stanford on their home court, it, it's always a good time. It was really fun to beat Stanford, and I got to lay out and uh, show everyone that I'm the original bronze goddess on our team, because I am so dark and bronze. You look very bronzed. Now we're here with Claire, and we want to know what your favorite part about Palo Alto was. My favorite part was beating Stanford at Stanford. Um, we've done that twice in my career. But the, my other favorite part was the Lululemon store. It is an athletic wear store that our team is obsessed with. And I spent way too much money. And thank God my parents were there to spot me a little bit. But I, it was probably my downfall. In what exactly well. did you buy? Did you get pants, jackets? Tell us. I already have a lot of pants, but I got a few jackets. I got four jackets and a bag and a pair of shorts. Rare. That's that's, That's doing some lot. work. That's a lot. What's up with the kitty cats? I don't, I don't know, the beige, the cats. I was wearing them for class today. They're my good luck socks. I had two exams today, and I think they brought me some good luck as well, and I just didn't want to take them off for stretching today. So. She's a superstitious one. Okay, Alex, you've been to one Elite Eight, two Sweet Sixteens, or about to be two Sweet Sixteens, the following Sweet Sixteen. What are you most looking forward to this weekend in Florida? Mm -hmm. Um, I'm ready for some warm weather. It started snowing, and I'm ready to, to play at Florida as well. Now, what are you looking forward to in Florida besides beating Florida? The warm weather. It was so nice in Palo Alto to be able to lay out while studying and, you know, watch Game Tracker of other games. Um, but it, I think the warm weather. Hopefully I don't spend as much money in Florida because uh, my parents will not be happy at me. I'm really excited to go to Florida because actually one of my old club teammates is the little Barrow on Florida's team, so that will be fun to see her. And also we're going to be somewhat close to Disney World, and that's my favorite place on Earth. Why is it your favorite place on Earth? Splash Mountain. That's where I'm going to be buried. Um, when I pass away, my family's going to cremate me, and they are all going to get in a log. And as they go over the big drop on Splash Mountain, they are going to release my ashes and they're gonna clear the two logs behind so you know the uh, tourists don't get me in their eyes or their mouth and I'm going to float around Splash Mountain for eternity. It's an inspiring story to all of us. Maybe we can stop by Disney World on our trip down to Gainesville. <laughs> we just found Cassie Petoskey and Lexi Zimmerman. They're here coaching. Now, did you guys watch the game at Stanford? No, we didn't see it, but we heard about I it. I didn't know it was on. I was watching Game Tracker though. Yes, we, we were, were game narrating the, the Game time. Tracker. Yes. How are you narrating the Game Tracker? Service ace, Courtney Fletcher. It's That's best. true, I, I just listened. It's my best Percy voice. That is them trying to be Percy and failing miserably. Sorry, Percy. Oh, oh, we have or. a special guest. <laughs> or, or it was service error, game point Courtney. in three, Courtney Fletcher and game four, Courtney <laughs> Fletcher. We didn't, we didn't announce that one. <laughs> but we didn't say that. That was no, not no, announced. No, no. We only said good things. Sherry. <laughs> that was really bad, I know. It won't happen again, I promise. Now, are you going to be um, keeping up with the team this weekend in the Sweet 16? No, now both of you guys have been to a Sweet 16, actually. Mm -hmm. Now, tell us about your experiences with that. Um, they were lovely. My favorite was at Stanford a couple years ago. Repeat this year. Good job. Really good record against Stanford. Lexi, how about you? Oh, it's very fun. The teams get better, so you guys can do it. <laughs> Support from the alumni, we love it. We're still all so close. <laughs> love you guys. Yeah. I love you guys. Love you. Good luck. <laughs> well, those were some interesting interviews. So Fletcher's going to take us through the next procedure to watch us this weekend. Um, keep updated with MGO Blue all week, and they will have information on watching us on either ESPN3 or ESPNU when we play for Florida on Friday at 7 p.m. Go Blue for MGOBlue.com. I'm Courtney Fletcher. And I'm Michelle McMahon. Go Blue. <laughs>